And we actually have some breaking news for you because we have just heard from the swimmers the weather window isn't good enough for the channel tomorrow, so they're doing it tonight on the River Hamble. Good luck to them all. So the River Hamble, the weather must be pretty good for an open water swim Well, tonight. it's mild, it's cloudy, a bit of drizzle. That's not going to bother any, anyone in the water, is it? Because if it's raining, yeah. it doesn't really anyway. matter. Yes, so it's mild. Let's put it this way. It's, it's not pouring with rain and it's not howling winds. Well, it's good luck to them. Good luck yes. to them for that challenge. Fingers crossed, yes. Let's take a look at your lovely weather pictures. John and Jean sent us this picture of the sunrise this morning in Selsey. And uh, Martin Perry captured the cloudy skies over Colwell Bay on the Isle of Wight. And Robbie Forrester 80 photographed this scene at Kingston Common near Ringwood. So today we had generally cloudy skies in many places, but we did see a little bit of blue in the sky in Oxfordshire and other places as well. This picture was taken by Tracy T, one of our weather watchers. Tomorrow's a decent day. We've got lots of sunshine on offer, blue skies overhead, some patchy cloud, and it will be breezy, but not as windy as today. Today we saw wind gusts of up to 40 miles per hour. Patchy rain is possible through this evening and overnight tonight. That cloud will sink its way southwards. It's a weather front. It will disappear, so the skies will clear behind and temperatures will range between 8 and 13 degrees. Quite a mild night to come in general. A breezy night though. The breeze is strong as today but it's coming in from the northwest and that means we're going to see a lot of sunshine during the day. There will be very high pollen levels and also very high UV levels during the course of the day. Lots of sunshine, some patchy cloud building in at times with a high of 19 to 20 degrees so temperatures are still above their seasonal average. Here's the coastal forecast tomorrow between Selzebill and Lyme Regis. The wind are west or northwest, three to five, veering northerly, three or four, becoming variable, three or less later, and the sea state is smooth or slight. Tomorrow night it's a quiet night, slightly cooler than recent nights with the clear skies. There will be that northerly breeze, so temperatures will fall away into single figures, lows of around five or six Celsius. We start Saturday with a good deal of sunshine, but as the day progresses with that northerly breeze, we'll start to see a little bit more cloud bubble up through the course of the afternoon, but it should stay mainly dry and temperatures are in the high teens, possibly up to 20 degrees in some places. So pleasant on Saturday, but feeling a lot cooler as we head into Sunday. Sunday, we're expecting cloudier skies, some bright and sunny spells, but also the chance of one or two sharp showers at a high of just 14 degrees. It's still quite a cool day on Monday next week. We're looking at some showers dotted about, maybe some patchy rain, but also some sunshine in the morning. As we head through next week, temperatures start to recover back up towards 19 to 20 degrees. The average for May is 16 Celsius, so temperatures on Sunday will be below, below the seasonal average. David. Thanks, Alexis. On tomorrow's programme, how schools are marking the Queen's Platinum Jubilee before they, of course, break up for half term. But from all the team here at South today, enjoy your evening. Bye bye. Good night.